ask yourself these three questions. In my work, do I come into contact with vulnerable people? Is my workplace at a higher risk of infection? Do I work on infrastructure or logistics that are critical to the territory? If your answer is maybe, or I don't know, you need to get the jab. Critically, the direction also applies to industries who directly face customers in circumstances where the worker may not know the vulnerability of the person they are interacting with. So it is simple. If your job includes interacting with members of the public, then you need to get the jab. If you work in hospitality, you need to get the jab. If you work in retail or in a supermarket, you need to get the jab. If you are behind the counter at the bank, if you're a receptionist or positions like that, you need to get the jab. If you are a barber, a hairdresser, a beauty therapist, you need to get the jab. All these workers and many, many more directly interact with members of the public. That means you are frontline workers in our economy. That means you must be vaccinated. Of course, there can be exemptions, but these are extremely narrow and must be backed up with medical evidence. Simply not wanting the vaccine is not a reason. Today, we're also announcing the date from which this mandate comes into effect. From Saturday, the 13th of November, if you have not received at least your first dose of a vaccine, you will not be permitted to attend your workplace in that role and a failure to comply with the direction is a $5,000 fine. That means that workers must have received at least their first dose by Friday the 12th of November at the latest. You have 30 days.